My husband requested for my children DNA test. Is my husband right or wrong? This video is two in one. Let's get started. Dead baby. What? Hello, hello everyone. Hello people. Welcome to my channel. This is Dead Beauty. My people, this video is two in one. Don't be in a rush, please. Just carry your popcorn and let's enjoy this video together. The first stage of this video is what you are saying now. I want to show you how I achieve the Igbo, Igbo traditional uh, bridal hair and my makeup. This video was made two months ago on my 40, 41 birthday photo shoot. I made it myself. Yes, everything uh, I do them by myself. Last year, I do the Okuku, the Bini Okuku. This year, I decided to do the Igbo uh, hair drop. But if I do, the way I do it on myself, though it's not that neat, but if I do it on your on someone's head, it's more neat. Okay, just focus your eye on my hand and see how I achieve this uh, Igbo. Maybe you wonder, you will pick up one or two things on this Igbo uh, traditional bridal hair. Thank you because I don't have more time to explain on the on the tutorial. All I need from you is just focus. But in case you want to do your photo shoot, Ibo, Bini, any traditional hairstyle, I base here in United Kingdom, London. We are into many one beauty. We do photo shoot. I have studio here. I have studio here in my in London. Just come contact me. We do makeup. We do gilly. We are all in one beauty. I'm available to travel as well. Okay, my people. So just concentrate your eye on that video and give me your ear as we dive into the part two, the second session of this video. These days, I always have a, a interesting topic on top of my video. So the other thing we are going to, it's a big question. The other thing we are going to deliberate on today, though I'm the only one talking, but on the comment section, if you have any contribution, feel free to drop your comments and uh, you feel free. My number is there on this video, on the last part of this video. You will see my number is there. Yes, it's a big question, my people. It's a big question. Please. Just feel free and drop your comment and uh, I want to see your comments. Okay, my husband asked me for DNA tests for my children. We are going, that is the next thing we are going to deliberate on, the second part. Is my husband, is he right or is wrong? It's a big question. Okay, my people, my fellow people there, my brothers and my sister, because the reason I always say my brothers and my sisters, I come across a man that tell me that, Deg, I always watch your video. So that is the reason I don't want to assume anymore that only ladies watch my video. So if you are there, you are a man, you are a woman, hearing the sound of my voice. Yes, this question is for everyone is my husband wrong by asking me that we should go for dna test for my children yes or no okay my own contribution on this question is my husband is not right at all it's not oh sorry my husband is not wrong at all my husband is not wrong if my husband asked me for my children DNA test. We should go for test. He's going. He's taking them to do DNA test. He is not wrong at all, my people. That is my own answer. Everybody have freedom of speech. This uh, question, you, I want your own contribution on the comment section. For me, my husband is not wrong at all. He's not wrong. It's not a big deal if your husband asks you for for DNA test for your children. If your husband is going for DNA test for 
his children. Okay, the reason I said he is right, because this generation that we are now, in fact, uh, everything is possible. Everything. Even the things that don't even come to your imagination. Everything is possible. We, uh, we human, some of the human beings that live on this earth, their hearts, I don't know how to describe their hearts. If I say their heart is more deeper than the Lucifer himself, that is even too small. Because I said it's, very, it's a good thing if any man, it's a good thing if any man asks for DNA. It's a good thing if any man said he's going for DNA test for his children. Don't twist it wrong and start saying, ah, you not trust me, you not trust me, you not trust me. Ah, my people. It's a good thing if any man had requested that he's going for DNA test. So for you hearing the sound of my voice, if you know that it's not it's not a good thing, drop it there. Because the reason I say it's a good thing, because if your husband suspects any foul foul play, if your uh, even though you don't even suspect any foul play, just to clear his conscience. And I don't like women that are always annoyed that the man asks for DNA tests. No. It's like you don't trust yourself. You don't trust yourself. Any boy, any man asks for DNA test for their child. It's not a, 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 a evil request. You just want to know if really he is the real father of this child. Because a lot, a lot is going on in this our generation. My people, it's not all that you see on, on Facebook, on social media. Those ones you see on social media, those ones are some more ones. Those one are some one. So women, when they are pregnant, especially every first child, when they are pregnant, many women that that that, uh, that cannot open their leg, that cannot close their leg. Sorry, some of them, when they just observe that they are pregnant, they will give to. They will try and give to this boy. If this boy refuses, they will go and give to, to the other boy. So this our generation, I see someone that want to bring his children to, to abroad. At the end, he now discover that he is not the father of those children. We have seen many things, even out of social media. So my answer in this question, if your husband asks you for DNA test, is a very good thing. Go and test your children. Go and test them if really these children are your children. So that you know that you you this this child is my child. For me, because the way the things are going on in this our generation, me I will even if for example I have the power to say to the government, any woman that put to bed first before they discharge that baby, they should go for DNA test. I will say it. Yes, I will say it. Because anything can happen in this our generation no trust no one the trust is there but for some women they go extra mind to do some things so my people please don't be annoyed of anyone that asks for dna test if some women they can deceive everybody around them but remember you cannot deceive god galatians 6 verse 7 said be not be deceived. God cannot be mocked. You can mock everybody. You cannot mock God. There is a song that always say, you cannot hide it for God. You may cover your sins and nobody may know. You cannot hide it for God. Some women, they will refuse to confess their sin until when you show red lights. Please, my people over there, if you suspect anything, ask for DNA tests. God bless you for your understanding. And if you uh, disagree with me, drop it on the comment section. Because this life is not what you think. 
that is going on. Many things are going on. Yes, I stand for it. Every man, ask for DNA test. If you suspect any foul play from your wife, go for DNA test so that you will know earlier the better for you. Thank you, everyone. This is the final. I'm just rocking my photo shoot. Yes, so bye-bye. See you on my next video. Bye. Lovely, yeah, yeah. Anywhere you go, you need some makeup love. In case you need your gay little bit tight.